Hey everybody, Riley here from Growing in the North. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing on the Hydro 50 Watt LED. Uh, just going to show everybody what it looks like, the weight, temperature, after it warms up, and uh, the draw wattage. Really excited to see this light in action and see what it can do. See you in a few. Okay, as promised, uh, this is the Hygro 50 watt full spectrum UFO LED. Uh, it's made by Hygro. Uh, this is the unboxing of it. Um, it says it's got the full spectrum here. Uh, the, uh, the actual draw is substantially lower than what it's rated for. Um, I don't think I'd get too, too much into that. Um, it draws 26 watts, it says. I'm going to be testing that on a power meter. And uh, that's more the, the number you should be concerned with rather than the 50 watts. 50 watts is just what the, the actual rating of the LEDs that are installed, but the 26 watts is the actual draw. So that's, that's more what the plants are more, more going to be concerned with. Uh, so here we go. Let's take a look. So I don't know if the company meant to do this or if it was an Amazon thing, but uh, I ended up getting three packages in one. So these are my power meters. I'm going to be taking those out later. Nice packed air. And there she is. So box in a box. It's good to see. some bubble wrap that's good on off switch also substantially lighter than what I thought it was going to be all right so looks like it's cast aluminum and nice and light nice reflector so hopefully you guys can see that, but 50 watts. I wish they'd actually label these with the actual draw that they have, but alrighty. Well, let's see what she does when we plug her in. All right, so these things are supposed to tell me everything I need to know. Power consumption, draw, I'm supposed to be able to set timers with them. Let's try the second one. I got two because I want to do two tests at once here. Okay, well, that's even odder. That one's on out of the box. Interesting. Alright, so plug number two in. Yep, that's bright. Alright. So I'm gonna have to read the instructions. You know what they say if all else fails, read instructions? Never mind, apparently we're just going to use these to set a program for the week. I was curious about this packed area, you know, like, where does the air come from? What's in there? Is it like factory air? Is it clean air? Hmm, I always wondered. All right. Let's get a weight on this bad boy. Mm. All right, 
weight, one pound, three-ish ounces. Not quite one and a quarter pound. Or 500 538, yeah, let's round up, that's 540 grams. So, yeah, half a kg, a little over a pound. Yeah, not bad. One nice thing, extremely light. You could hang this anywhere. You could hang this off of a curtain if you wanted to. Definitely handy that way versus them big heavy things. Okay. So it's been on for about an hour. I'm just going to do a temperature check here. Twenty-two point one degrees Celsius, which is seventy-one point eight Fahrenheit. That's not bad. Been running for a while. That's about as warm as she's gonna get. Right, I'll tell you what the temperature of the wall is, just for reference. Sixty-six point four Fahrenheit. Mm, not quite. Well, three degrees difference. Yeah. Celsius. Um, geez, that's not bad at all for what we could grow down there. Um, just wanted to show you guys this real quick here. Hopefully you can see that. That is 31.1 watts of draw for that guy. Which is actually above and beyond their 26. Um, they said 26 watts average power draw. Definitely like to see a little more than a little less. Not too bad. Alright guys, uh, if you liked my video, hit the thumbs up and the subscribe button. If you have any questions, comments, send them my way. I'll do my best to answer what I can. Uh, at the bottom of the page, there'll be some links to everything that I use. Um, the light, the timer, and the uh, power meter to test your actual wattage. Those are nice to have, just in case you're not sure what you're dealing with. They did send it to me for a test, so uh, the next video here is going to be on actually using this light to grow some lettuce. It'll be on a separate video though. Uh, check it out.